Michael Andrula, CKO trainer. Woo! What's happening, guys? We're gonna do a squat thrust and a jumper, push up, row, push up, row, front kick on that bag over there. This is kind of like when you're playing a horseback and you, uh, basketball and you do like a jump shot off the beam. You know, you just build up a lot of crap one, right into one movement. I'm all about effectiveness, efficiency. If you watch any of the workouts, we, we, our main goal is to make sure that every single second you're allocating to working out, you get the maximum out of it, and that's key. So what we're gonna do is grab these hand weights right here. You gotta watch all the past tutorials. This is like educational. Stop fooling around, watch the thing. Shoulder blades pinched together. You're gonna drop your body weight down. I'm gonna place the hands in between my feet. Chest out, shoulder blades pinched together. Now, if you have any bad knees or something like that, or go get, talk to a doctor. Let me say that again. Talk to a doctor. Don't tempt this at home. You're gonna kick both feet out. Chest is over your hands. This is clutch. If chest isn't over your hands, you're gonna end up just using a lot more shoulders and triceps, which isn't bad, but a lot of people wanna develop their chest, like Eric, especially, he's asking for chest exercises. Whether you're doing a bench press, a powerlifting bench press, or you're doing a push up, you want your chest out, arms down low. That way you can use your entire chest, your shoulders, plus your triceps, All right? chest out, one push up, stabilize yourself, maybe kick a foot out, one row. It helps to have heavier weights, but what the hell? Demonstration purposes, right? One row, push up, pull the feet back in, hang clean, front press, front kick, front kick, freeing on back. Ready to do that again, squat thrust, kick your feet out, one push up, one row, one row. You gotta make the sound effects. Pull the feet in, hang clean, push press, front kick, front kick, woo! Squat, kick feet up, push up, row, push up, row, push up, woo! Kick feet in, hang clean, press, front kick, front kick. If you don't have a bag, you're gonna substitute front kick, front kick with knee, knee. Back straight, shoulder blades pitched together. Drop the body weight down. You're asking how many reps are you doing here? You wanna do as many reps as you feel comfortable in a safe manner. If you're exhausted, do less reps. If you can only do two, do two. If you can't do any, build up to it. You can break these down. For instance, you can do a squat separately. Take your time, get a push up position. Take your time, do a push up. No weights, pull the arm back. No weights, pull the arm back. But if you're doing that, you might not be watching my videos. So let's get back to it. Squat, kick feet out, one push up, row, push up, row. Make sound effects, woo! Pull the feet in, squat, hand clean, push press, right knee, left knee, and so on. Let's, let's throw out a number for you. Do 10 reps, five sets, Go ahead, go ahead and enjoy your day after that because you're gonna be burning massive amounts of calories. Any exercise where you're doing up and down motions, using major muscle groups and chains of muscle groups, you're not just isolating one muscle group. You're working lots of muscle groups all at one. You burn more calories. You get more results. You get the gems, you get the diamonds, you get the Denali, you win the lottery, I don't know. Everything starts coming in line. Email me, Mike at Club Kale Gyms. CKOTrainer.com, 